Hey everyone, Yogesh here. Welcome to my channel, Utilize Your Business. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build countdown timer in your email so that your email stands out from the rest of the people. And our video starts right now. Welcome back. Now, if this is your first time watching the video from this channel, make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit the notification button because every week we do come up with a new video so that you're notified for our next uh, new video. Now, going back to what this video is all about, how to set up uh, countdown timers in your email so that your emails stand out and use those countdown e emails for any offers you're doing it, countdown to, you know, sales you have it or any discount coupons you have it. And building it, it's pretty simple. So first we gotta do is head over to centric.com. This is the website. So just uh, type in centric.com centric.com and you will have their front page like this for time zone depending on whatever time zone you add pick the correct time zone when does your timer you want to end pick that up uh, for this example we'll pick 30th language you can have other language but you're going to put english and this is what you can change for your background similar to maybe the logo colors that you are using it or the colors that you have in your emails that you're using it so for this example i'm going to be sending it with this and you can see it i don't have any background logo or any any color scheme and all that you can make it to whatever you want so i just want to show you uh, how you can change it so here you can pick any different colors and just apply lab label and digits you want that they're right now they're white in color you want them to be in different color so they stand out and this one background just click to right here to this and it will generate and this is the code it will generate right here so this is what you get it and like I said you can probably change if you want to change the background right here right labels leave it same digit you can do something like that and then this is how you, you know so you get an idea of how you can use different colors to match your color screen and this is what you will need now this is the htm code that you can type into any email autoresponder you have it some of them will be easier you can just copy all of it and some of some of the emails for autoresponder you might need to copy just the image code so and this example i'm going to be using aweber since this is the most of the uh, stuff is all about affiliate marketing and Aweber is one of the email responder which are affiliate friendly and I use that as one of my autoresponders especially for one I'm going to be using for you know sending affiliate offers through the email so what you need to do is just drag the image element and then right here where it says image URL you need to do is just copy the image and then you go here and that's what you have it and then you can make it bigger or smaller anything else you what you want to do is there everything else seems to be fine so we just want space between these two. So all I usually do is, and then just have the padding and the same thing for the bottom, right? Now it looks a little bit better and just make sure everything else is, seems fine. Yeah. All right, so let's preview this. Let's send it. I'm going to send it to myself. 
one of my email account as a test message. I'll make sure that how we get it. All right, so now let's go into my Gmail account. And this is how you have it. You have the timer, you have everything there. This is how you can use the timers in countdown timers in your emails that you send out to as a affiliate offer or as a coupon or a countdown to a sale. You can use the automation and just you gotta do is copy this this image URL or if you're using the HTML code, what you gotta do is just copy the whole code and paste it in your email and that should uh, that should be enough and you, you can use this not only in uh, aweber as example on this you can use it in active campaign is another email uh, i use it i really liked it or any other email transponders that you have it that you're using it hopefully you like this uh, video and if you do and you get value of this make sure to give a thumbs up put something in the comment and this way the YouTube will show it to other people and they can also get the value and learn how they can use timer countdown for their emails. All right guys, see you in the next video.